A sitemap is a list of URLs that links to all the pages on your website. They are used by search engines to better understand your website and ensure that the search results are displayed correctly. Creating a sitemap is one of the best ways to ensure that your website is properly indexed by search engines. It also gives a user-friendly overview of all the pages on your website. Search engine spiders, crawls, and indexes all of the web pages on a site to ensure that they are properly indexed. This will enable Google to understand and be able to find your website. WordPress includes built-in sitemap support, but it has certain limitations. That is why you can add additional sitemaps. The sitemap helps Google to understand and crawl your website content, which we just talked about. Yoast SEO automatically generates a sitemap for your website, and it also allows you to make changes to the sitemap according to your requirements. Hi guys, this is Jasmine Valia from Team Learn Today, and in this SOP, we will create a sitemap for your WordPress website using Yoast SEO plugin. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Once you're on your WordPress dashboard, in order to get your XML sitemap, what you need to do is look into your left sidebar and you will find this particular plugin, Yoast SEO, which we installed in one of the previous SOPs. So if you have not installed Yoast SEO yet, go ahead and install it. And if you do not know how, I have uploaded a video in one of the previous SOPs, which I will link right here. So go ahead, install Yoast SEO, pause this video, go check out the SOP, install Yoast SEO, and then come back to this video. All right, moving forward, once you have installed Yoast SEO, what you need to do is go to general from right here. Once you have landed on your general Yoast SEO window, scroll down a little bit and you will find that there's dashboard, features, integration, and webmaster tools. You need to go to features from right here. And there are several features over here. If you scroll down a little bit, you will find SEO analysis, readability analysis, text link counter, and various other features. You will also find XML sitemaps right here, and it would be on by default. And to get your XML sitemap, all you need to do is click on this question mark, which is right here. Enable the XML sitemap that Yoast SEO generates. So all you need to do is see the XML sitemap. Click on this and it will take you to a different window. And this is your sitemap. This will contain all the posts and all the pages that you have already um, uploaded or published in your website. Um, so go ahead get this sitemap and the next step is on our next SOP which I will be uploading tomorrow so stay tuned for that and to get your sitemap indexed we will be talking about this in the next video so do watch that video and yeah you have successfully generated your XML sitemap for your WordPress website. Hope you guys were able to install the Yoast SEO plugin and generate your XML sitemap for your WordPress website. Now that you know how important it is to get your website indexed, in our next SOP, we will be learning how we can go ahead and submit the XML sitemap for our website on Google Search Console in order to get it indexed. Go ahead, hit on that like button, subscribe button, along with the notification bell icon so that you can get updates on whenever we come up with the next video. This is Justin Valia, and I will see you in our next SOP.